I've got something terrible, awful, horrific to admit to you guys. I took a break. I, I just, I, I couldn't, I couldn't take it anymore. We've been playing it nonstop for a month straight. I just couldn't handle it. No, I'm just kidding. I, I actually, I had to go to a friend's 30th birthday weekend this weekend up in Charleston, South Carolina, and I could not play this game all weekend long, and I missed it, dude. Holy cow, did I miss it. What's up, guys? Welcome back to some more MLB 21 Road to the Show. We are back, and today we are going to be playing against the Braves, at least here for game one. Clayton Kershaw on the mound for us. Ian Anderson, we're going to be going up against, and uh, here we go. Let's just uh, let's just go ahead and hop into it. So, man, does it feel good to be back? I did take a break. It was not, you know, anything that I necessarily wanted to do. I mean, I was excited to go see him and celebrate him and stuff like that. I had a great time, but um, I missed this game genuinely. When I was on the plane back home uh, last night, I was like typing up and, and thinking, you know, ideas for episodes and things we could do and, and specialty episodes and stuff. So, uh, hopefully you guys are excited for some more MLB. I know we missed an upload yesterday. I'm sorry about that. That's the only video that I missed for like, I was gone Tuesday through through Sunday. That's the only video that I couldn't get done for that stint that I was going to be gone. And um, yeah, we're back. So, we're going to be grinding this out. Definitely daily episodes. Probably some days with two episodes. There's some other games I want to start up and, and stuff like that too. So, um, going to get back into it. And uh, I, I can't wait. If you guys have any ideas of... of you know, themes for episodes that we can do. Get there. We're not going to get there. Bounce it off the wall. Let me go ahead and, I guess, get it into our cutoff, man. I tried to throw it to second. He didn't throw it. Oh, we're going to get him. He's done. Let's go. Look at that. Faked him out with the, the you know, pump fake to second base. Sniped him at third. Let's go, fellas. Homie got way too aggressive. That's what I'm talking about. That's how we get it done. We come back and play some great defense accidentally. All right. So one thing I was kind of curious about because we, we literally, I've played this game daily for a month now. I was curious if like four or five days off was going to cause, you know, a little bit of rust here. So we're about to find out. This is legitimately our, our first at bat back. So four seam change up, 12 six curve at a two seam. Here we go. Ooh, it, it feels weird. We got a single. We got a single, our first hit back, some good PCI movement. I don't know, guys. Maybe, maybe you know, sometimes you do need to take a little bit of a, bit of a break to, you know, reset and regain and, and you know, find yourself again. So we'll, we'll see what happens. Hopefully that's the case here. But, um, yeah, man, I'm, I'm excited. Got some cool ideas for episodes, special episodes. I think we're going to gonna mix it up. You know, okay, I got picked off. Well, Can't win them all. It's all right. We're going to be... <laughs> Dude, what? Who? Since when? We didn't take an extra step. So this game has never tried to pick me off at first like that before, and I'm kind of upset about it. Top of the fourth here. Got a couple of guys on. Only swing at pitches inside the zone and drive a home run. Or drive in a run. Sorry, home run. What am I talking about? Make contact with every swing and drive in a run. Both of these are going to be pretty tough. I think I'd rather... Our plate vision is almost at 50, so I think we'd rather go with clutch. Okay. Here we go. Four-seam change up, 12-6 curve, and a two-seam. Guys in the corners with two outs. First pitch coming. Here it is. A bouncer to the left side. Got a little bit too far up on that one, unfortunately. We're going to end up grounding it out, and uh, that's not going to be what we were looking for. Not going to get any clutch for that. Here we go. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking we're going to have, you know, just kind of normal episodes like this. I'll, I'll try to, you know, pick some fun series when we're facing, like, interesting pitchers and stuff like that. And that'll be the focus. But then I definitely want to mix things up. I want to start messing with, you know, some of our batting stances and our, our pitching wind-ups and, and home run celebrations. And, like, I, I was thinking we could do one where, like, we take all of our equipment and all of our perks off. And, and we go to, like, bare bones playing. And, and I don't know. Guys, have any any fun ideas? Any fun, you know, kind of themes for episodes? Let me know, just to kind of mix things up a little bit. We've also got to start messing with the stadium creator more because I think you can play if you've got a home game. I think you can change your home stadium to custom created stadiums, so that's going to be kind of fun. Um, we'll see what happens. Still a tie ball game at zero zero here. Nobody on and one out. Four seam change up, twelve six curve at a two seam. A little bit low on that change up. Waited on it well, Trev. Looked looked at it, saw it well. It was just a little bit too far out of the zone. 
Oh, well hit ball. That might be worth two. It's going to find the gap there. That's what I'm talking about. Definitely going to be worth the uh, the extra base there. All right, so we're two for three so far on the day. Nothing too crazy. But we'll, we'll get it done. Adam Hazley up to bat. Got somebody in scoring position. Come on, fellas. I can be the... Uh, the difference maker here. That's going to be a pop up to uh, to left. Oh, what? I guess when when you're angled that way and you press back or left on the stick, it sends you to third. All right. Well, I guess we are a little bit rusty. We're hitting well. We're just nothing else is is working. All right. I'm going for a hit a home run. Here we go. Four seam slider curveball. Let's get it. Top of the ninth. We're up by one. Offering on its way. Fouled away. I force him. Wanted to take a, a, a bite of that one. Yeah, that's. I guess it makes sense because third was to my left from that camera angle, but Ready technically, me as a runner, third oh, base was to my on. right because you know facing home. I don't. I don't know. That's just that. That's kind of a kind of a weird setup there. I don't. I don't like that. I was just trying to go Here back. Go back to the base. Ooh, he's pushing us back off the plate. All right, one two count here. Let's go, Trev. No strikeouts. No strikeouts. Come on, baby. Die! I tried to check it, and it, did. it was inside, so we flinched. And I hate that it does that, man. Who's going to flinch at something down at your feet? I would definitely, definitely flinch. Okay. Bottom of the ninth here. We are three outs away from winning this ball game. Come on, baby. Ooh, my goodness, we're going to extra innings. That's unfortunate. I think it landed to our left there. All right. Well, tie ball game. We did end up winning, though, so we'll take it. All right. Got lucky. Ah, here we go. We've got a training day. I'm excited about this. So I did see a couple of people mention me on Twitter the reason why, at least hopefully, we'll see what happens. But the reason why we keep checking the bullpen and we never see any sort of, you know, add a pitch style thing. I guess you have to do a couple of other bullpen activities first and then eventually it will show up. I thought they just kind of, you know, randomly changed to each, each time you pulled it up. But I guess it, it pretty much always kind of gives you the same selection until you choose something. And then it will refresh it and give you something new in a future time. So uh, definitely don't want to replace anything. I'm happy with our pitches that we have thus far. So we could do sequence memory or we could, you know, kind of add to our, our tertiary pitch here. You could add control or break. Interesting. Kind of feel like break might be pretty good. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with that. We're going to add some break to our, uh, our curveball and... Uh, I mean, that, that sounds Sports pretty good to me. psychology has really exploded as an industry over the last couple decades, but for baseball, the mental side of the game has been discussed for almost a century, maybe longer. No, oh, it, it, listen, it's the ultimate individual team sport, right? It's golf. At the end of the day, you're on an island, and that guy on the mound's on an island. It's a one-on-one -on -one, -on -one wrestling match, right? No one can help you. Mommy, daddy, um, you know, your coach, your hitting coach. No, there's your brother, your sister. No one can help you. You, you literally, you're, you're one with your thoughts. And if you can't get your thoughts under control, if you can't get a good breath to slow the game down, there's so many things that go in to that, to that matchup by yourself. And I think that's the difference between guys that become superstar big leaguers and guys that don't make it. Dude, that's a really cool outlook right there. All right. We are going to be playing the Yankees, baby. Let's get into it. Oh, man, we've got an exciting first inning happening here. We've already got two runs and another guy waiting to come in, but two outs. Let's see if we can be uh, be clutch here. Sinker, slider, change up, but a four seam. That's low. Be able to lay out that one. Here we go. Coming off of uh, a strikeout in that last game. Not exactly what we wanted, but uh, we're going to be okay. That's low. Looking pretty good. Feeling, seeing. Being one with the ball. I love it. Here we go. Well hit sinker right there. Man, that thing. Oh, that had some power on it. That was going to go the distance for sure if we were able to connect the, the timing a little bit better. 1-2 count here. Or 2-1, I'm sorry. Make it 3-1. Here we go. 
exactly where we want to be. I don't want to be walked, though. Come on, Trev. Is that a home run? That's got to be a home run, dude. Yes, sir! Dude, I... Dirk Dingers! I don't know, man. I don't know. I think taking a little break. Tanning my cheeks on the beach. May have kind of worked a little bit. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Holy cow. Just absolutely smacked two back-to-back -back right there. Unfortunately, one of them was foul. That low fastball. 3-1 count. We knew he had to pitch us something. We pretty much knew we were going to be swinging on that count. So, made it a little bit easier for us. Hit the deep part of the ballpark and uh, sent it, baby. Give us a 4-0 lead to start things off. Top of the third here. Time to play a little bit of defense. I feel like our defense and base running has left a, a bit to be desired here so far in this, this episode. So, let's just go ahead and catch that and uh, call it a day. There it is, dude. Holy cow. I was nervous. I remember in the past... When we played this game, I remembered uh, just that, that, like, when I would have to go on trips and stuff like that, I'd come back and I'd be a little bit rusty. So I'm glad it's not the case this time around. Four seam change up, 12 6 curve and a slider. A little bit early on the four seam, obviously excited, obviously, you know, kind of wanting to repeat our last at bat here. Let's not get too far ahead of ourselves, but we freaking did it. Dirk Dingers! Ringing that bell, baby. Dude, I need, I need to get a bell for my desk. I'm going to order one on Amazon right now. That's a great idea. The home run bell. Because it's, you know, the Phillies. Holy cow. I'm actually going to do it. Right, I got to do it later. I don't, uh, we, we can probably do it now. This probably isn't the most exciting thing in the world. But um, desk bell? That's actually a fun idea. All right. Well, we, we've got like restaurant bells. That's not really what I'm looking for, though. I'm thinking more of like, I'll have to look it up. There's probably a Phillies merch bell that I could end up end up purchasing. That'd be kind of fun. Dirk Dingers, you know, like a cowbell type thing. I don't think that's what it sounds like, but. Here we go. I don't think we have to jump for this. I think we can just catch this here. There it is. That's what I'm talking about. Starting to get the defense, you know, kind of fired up a little bit here. Obviously, the bats are hot. Bottom of the six. Got a guy on first base. Curve, four-seam change up, and a two-seam. Domingo German. It's outside. Here we go. Dude, I'm going to be honest. I'm... I'm Really tired today. It kind of took me a while to get going. Took me a while to get everything fired up and ready to record. There's no way. It, it, warning track, dude. <laughs> if we would have... <laughs> that that, that would have been outrageous. But yeah, I'm a little bit tired, so I'm surprised. Because this game, it takes a lot of mental focus to, you know, kind of watch the ball and time it and stuff like that. So, I was nervous. I was, I was definitely nervous. Here we go. Ooh, we're going to have to jump for this. It's R1, right? How do you jump for the ball? This happened to us a couple episodes ago. Trainer is out to visit Dirk Dingers. Suffered an undisclosed injury on the previous play, and he will need to be removed from the game. He is going to have to enter the ball game here as he'll take over and left. Well, that wasn't exactly a nail biter, but it's always nice when you can get an offensive explosion like that. We were hot too. I I I wanted my fourth and maybe fifth at bat right there if we could have kept things rolling. Blister on the finger. <laughs> I got a blister from diving right there. Okay, well, I'm thinking we're probably going to be able to be able to, you know, tough that out. Funny enough, yeah, we're going to be playing in the next game. Funny enough, I've actually got blisters on each of my feet. Me and my boys, we always play spike ball really, really hard. Like, we're, we are super intense about spike ball. It's one of my favorite games in the world. And when you play on the beach all day for like two or three days straight, the skin starts to fall off the bottom of your feet. So, I'm, uh... 
Man, I I'm in, I'm in rough shape. It's a good thing my my you know day to day life is is sitting in here playing video games in a chair. Otherwise, I'd I'd be in trouble. So, here we go. Game two against the uh, the Yanks. Let's go, baby. We're down one to zero here to start things. I'm should I even try it? Oh, maybe you have to keep running at the wall. Maybe. Maybe because I, I, I go against the wall and then I stop moving the left stick. Maybe that's the issue. Yeah, we, we might we might be onto something here. All right. First at bat. Now bottom of the second. Nobody on. Really nobody really out. Night. And a two-run deficit. Four-seam slider, knuckle curve, change up, and a two-seam. Let's get it popping. Knuckle curve. Okay. It's a nasty pitch right there. Let's go. Gonna foul off the four seam a little bit late there, down 0-2. This is not the situation we want to be in. He's gonna get crafty here. Slow. Gonna lay up that one. I would say he's probably gonna try to give us something close here, but it's 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 gonna be a strikeout pitch. Ooh, he didn't. He hit us a, sl a, a slider right up in the zone. We're gonna be able to get a single. All right, we'll take it. Way to get out of that, Trev. Way to stay in there. Way to, way to stay focused. Way to see everything. Way to not panic because you're down 0-2. I'm going to see if we can steal this base right here. we got to make up for our getting picked off earlier and then making that base running error, mistake, whatever you want to call it, when we, we accidentally ran and then got tagged up. Come on, man. I, I'm not giving up on this. Your boy's a little bit slow. He kind of he needs he needs the extra the extra foot there. I'm gonna take what I can get. Ooh, good jump, good jump. We're in there. Let's go. We'll take it. All right. Way to redeem yourself, Trev. Offense is looking good. Defense started rough, improving. Base running started rough, improving. That's what I'm talking about. This is where we want to be. We got a boosted bat here for JT Real Muto. Let's go, homie. Let's go. It's all right. We're still in scoring position. Come on, fellas. What do you say we, we put one on the board here? Looks like Adam Hazley is going to be getting some sort of a hit. I'm going to take off. I'm going to take off. Oh. Straight zinger right at first base right there. He makes a great play. All right. Here we go, Trev. Apparently, singles aren't going to get it done. You got to jump the uh, jump the wall here. You're next to bat and get the chance. Are you serious? Ooh. Oh, my bad. Wrong button. L1 is your cutoff, man. R1 is to jump. I had R1 on my head because we were going to be going up the wall. Dude, it, it's... It's just a crap shoot out there in, in left field today. We're down by five. Got a guy on first base, no outs. Here we go. It's low. And in the zone. All right. Good pitch. Here we go. It's outside. 1-1 one, one count. Let's go, baby. This game is, is not looking good, but it's not over yet. Here's the one one. Swinging bunt, we're safe. I'm gonna get there. I'm gonna beat it out. No, I'm not. That was way too far outside. We shouldn't have been swinging at that, Trev. It's all right though. We advanced the runner, put in, in scoring position. I guess it could have been worse, but it got us nowhere. Still five to nothing. Top of the fifth. Gonna have a pop up out here. Got a guy on second base. So we gotta be smart about this. All right, it's L1. Catch the ball. We got L1 pre pre selected. Come on, let's go. There it is. Right. Top of the fifth. We're down by seven. Apparently, this is not our ball game, fellas. Gonna be coming to us. Get there. Okay. I mean, we still got a second half of the ball game to go here, but our boys are gonna have to get something done. Looks like we got one. Oof. Be able to get there. Come on. Yes. Beautiful. All right. Let's see if we can get something popping here. Bottom of the six, two outs, nobody on. Perfect. This is exactly how I wanted to come to bat here. Oh, my goodness. Dirk Dinger. 
Dude, that's going to be really cool when we have it. I'm excited for it. I'm going to have to order that here soon. The home run bell. Coming up with some, some fun stuff here. Would have been nice if our, our boys could have got on base there. We could have added a couple of extra runs, a couple of RBIs on our, our, you know, stat sheet, stuff like that. But no, it's just going to make it a 7-2 ball game. And make it 8-2. Just stand there and watch it, man. Watch the hope of winning this ball game fade away. All right. Bottom of the eighth, we're down by six with two men on. Four seam curve and a two seam. Very rarely, Matt, do you see a first pitch changeup hit out of the ballpark. That tells me right now that this guy was up there looking for the changeup in that last at bat. We'll that was rough. Pitch him any differently here. As we near the end of this one, it's clear the long ball has played a big role. It's outside. Dude, I mean, this this should be an easy hit here, dude. Two, two, you know, fastballs as well as a curveball. Just, you know, it's either on. You know, Dero, one of the things about pitching. See, they're on speed or off speed. Most likely on speed. We know we have a good chance it's going to be a, a pretty quick one, and it's, it's. I don't know. We should be able to rip this one. I hope. I guess technically every pitch is either on speed or off speed. So that was kind of a, a stupid thing for me to say right there. We were below. That four seam, 102 mile an hour four seam. Holy mother of baloney. Gonna foul that one off, 101 mile an hour. We are way late on these things. We're getting closer though. He's gonna hit us with the curve though. We're gonna go swinging like a, a dingus. It's outside. I knew he was gonna do it. Come on, bro. All right, full count. Fought our way back, let's go. You don't have to come into the zone on that count, but a pitch that far outside isn't going to tempt Two seam, that's going to be enough to get an RBI, I hope. Yes, he's going to round and get home. All right, we'll take it. I mean, it's I, I, I would prefer to flip-flop our last two at-bats and put the home run with the two men on. But, hey, we're keeping it alive. We're keeping the dream. Here we go. We get a full count for Reese Hoskins. Let's go, baby. Come on, fellas. Let's get these bases loaded, maybe? Nope. He's going to strike out. All right. We're fine. We still got two more to play with. Right in the heart of our order. Please. Please don't. Come on, Jay. Let's go, JT. Let's go, bro. Thanks. Whole team's kind of struggled in, in this game. Apart from us. I think we're three for four, right? So... Just not uh, not the ideal situation for us. So we're going to strike out one, two, three with two men on. We are not. He's going to round for third. I'm going to stay put on second just to be safe. And we're going to end up getting one more run there. All right, we'll take it. Starting to bring it back here. Come on, baby. Ronald Torres, eighth in the, the order. Torres, be the hero. Be the hero, Ron. Be the hero, Ron. Let's go, baby. I'm going all the way home. They got him at first. Holy cow. What a play by Short right there. That was impressive. All right. Well, unfortunately, I think that's going to end up being the ball game. Although, depending on what happens, we may end up getting another at bat here. Let's see. Gonna be popping it up to us. We're not gonna be able to get there. Ooh, short wheel though. Good stuff. All right, way to cover for us. Appreciate you. This is my real estate out here, but uh, you got it done. Bottom of the ninth. Two men on, two outs. Four seam, twelve six curve slider and a splitter. Holy cow! This is big. Three for four in the day so far. We've been hitting dingers left and right. Let's go, Dirk. It's outside. Let's go, baby. We've had, I mean, honestly, this is one of my best episodes yet. One of our, our best performances yet. Have we hit three home runs in an episode before? I don't think we have. Checked. It's, it's a strike anyway. Pretty sure. Was it not? Wow. Really close. All right. Good, good eye, Trev. Good eye. 2 0 count. Hitters count 3 0 count. Advance the runners. All right. Put them on second and third. We'll take it. Nope. They're just going to stay put. Why? I'm not sure, but okay. Here we go. 3 0 count. That was ball four? You're going to pitch me. Should have let that one go by. Focus, Trev. Focus. Let's go. Swing and a ground ball. 
dude, look at our PCI. It was good. We, we, I mean, we had a good read on that. Had a good, good timing on it. Went, you know, a little bit late, I guess, technically, but still pretty much right in the center of the ball field. Just didn't, didn't find that gap. It's all right. Three for five with a home run, two ribbies. We're not going to be able to win every game. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm so stoked to be back, dude. Like, I'm, I'm a little bit tired today. Wanted to make sure I got this video up for you guys. Didn't want to miss one. Um, can't wait to wake up early tomorrow morning and just get on the grind, baby. Thank you guys so much. If you guys have ideas for fun episodes, leave them down below. It's time for me to go buy that bell. Peace out.